Hmm, Iowa, just the name even sounds cool, don't you think? <laughs> I think it's a place where people are very um, principled, they live lives based on their values and their convictions, but at the same time, people are very open-minded and accepting of other people with different beliefs and different opinions. That's something I found to be true of our state as well. Hello, my name is Olivia Myers and I am the current Miss Iowa. Do I love Iowa? Absolutely, I better because I'm Miss Iowa <laughs> representing it. But. I think my favorite thing about living in Iowa is that no matter where I go, when I tell people I'm from here, they say, oh, that's a really great place to raise a family. And when it comes down to it, it is. You know, that's what I've experienced. They're just really kind, caring people and good communities. As I've traveled around the state this year making appearances as Miss Iowa, it seems that wherever I go, people are warm and welcoming and they want to get to know a little bit about me and they're willing to share about themselves as well. And that's what it means, I think, to be an Iowan, to live in our state. It is distinctly Iowa. I enjoy eating sweet corn very much. <laughs> Being outdoors and, I, you know, I don't often ride in the tractor with my grandpa, <laughs> but if I ever just want to get away and have a conversation with him, I can do that. I can get in the John Deere, you know, and <laughs> just enjoy the afternoon. Uh, misconceptions about Iowa, well, you know, there really hasn't been anyone who's who said anything too out there or, or too uh, ridiculous about our state, I don't think, although I have come to realize that people often confuse it with Idaho or Ohio, <laughs> and in fact, when I was at Miss America, every now and then we'd be doing roll call and I'd hear my name twice, I'd hear Miss Iowa twice, or I'd hear Idaho twice, <laughs> and the other state was left out. <laughs>